Well, the gong sounds, the curtain opens, and a heavenly scene is right before your eyes. That is what you can expect at Shen Yun. Joining us now is Su Yi. She is with the Asian Art Foundation, one of the sponsors of Shen Yun Performing Arts. Welcome. We're so happy to have you here. Absolutely. Thank you. I'm excited to be here. Yeah, so give us a little idea of the world of Shen Yun. Yeah, absolutely. So Shen Yun Performing Arts is a world's premier classical Chinese dance. And it is. Uh, it was established in 2006 in New York. Shen Yun's mission is to revive genuine traditional Chinese culture. It is bringing back to life a lost culture through beautiful art. It is a performance, but it is also beyond just a performance. It is a revival of the goodness of China before communism. So we're looking at some of the video now, and I can see that it's, you know, absolutely incredible dancing and, and a lot of beautiful formations. So um, tell us about this. It looks like it's almost to me a combination of a little bit of ballet, a little bit of gymnastics, and kind of in its own unique way. Yeah, it is a classical Chinese dance, actually, what you're seeing, which is the most expressive and athletic dance form in the world. And without speaking a word, you can just see, looking at your artist's facial expression, body movements, you understand what's going on, the storylines. And the costumes really seem to be a big part of it, too. I mean, such they're, they're very beautiful and soothing colors. Oh, it is a brilliant color, actually, honestly. And then these costumes are, are handmade. And wow. together, too, every year they bring on brand new show. All costumes are brand new each time. And uh, so the music that is played, I understand, is live music. It's it's an orchestra, yeah? It is an orchestra, which actually there's a secret about this music. <laughs> I want to tell you about this music. It's very soothing. It's also rejuvenating people. Uh, one thing about Shen Yun's music, in, in Chinese, there's a saying, music before medicine. Mm. So good music really gives you a healing power. So Shen Yun's music, blending the West and the East, really has that power. One example is a physician patron who watched the show and came out and said she's a physician, she used her hand to heal people, but Shen Yun's music is a prescription to joy and to honor. Yeah, I mean, I have to say, I'm a person who loves music. I'm a singer myself. Oh, I love to sing. So I, I have to agree with you. I think that music can be a very powerful kind of healing and also just very soothing. I think it, for yes. anyone, you start your day off, right? And if you have the right kind of surroundings, right kind of music, right kind of feeling, it sets you into the right tone. Indeed and a very slow stirring as well. Touches your heart, grabs your soul. Yeah, th yeah, that's the best art. So tell me a little about these dancers look amazing. I mean, they're doing things in formation. They're doing these incredible acrobatic feats. What does it take to become a Shen Yun dancer? Oh, hours and hours of trainings. And, and just you can only imagine that we actually have a video online that, talking about Shen Yun's, you know, um, the dancers' hours of training. And they're all... All of everybody's actually from different parts of the world oh, wow. gather together in a classically trained in New York. So everybody working very hard to share this beautiful lost art with the audience. Yeah, so that is an interesting point too because even though it's celebrating the Chinese culture, it is based in New York. So tell me a little bit about that. Yeah, yes. So classical Chinese dance, it is based in New York, but it cannot be seen in China uh, very unfortunately because Shenmue's mission is to revive genuine traditional Chinese culture but under the communist regimes ruling mainland China over the last 70 years literally wiped out the traditional Chinese culture so uh, to revive the culture cannot be inside of China can only be outside of China so that's why it is based in New York Gotcha. Okay, so explain to someone who hasn't seen the show, because I think a lot of people, myself included, I've seen the ads before, right? But I've never been to the show. So what is the feeling that you have when you go see the show? Oh, gosh. This is a, it's an extraordinary experience that will delight your senses mm -hmm. and really enrich your mind and uh, leaving you feel rejuvenated. That's actually a lot of feedback from audience members is that they feel healed, hearts are healed. They feel the sense of hope and optimism for the world. So do you have a favorite part of the show that you always look forward to? Oh, there's so many things. I want to say about the 3D uh, backdrops, actually. So it's, just a, it's like a movie. It takes you to different scenery. It's very visual, and it keeps you in. So you will really be captivated by the entire performance. Yeah, that looks really neat, because some of the sets are kind of digitally behind them, yeah. right? So they're yeah. able to do that. It's kind of amazing now how you can do almost more than you could do years past when you had to have 
have actual, you know, a scrim or different set pieces. Yeah. Now you can do just about anything. Yeah, well, actually, it's a pattern, and it's actually give a lot of uh, audience, mem audience members surprises about this backdrop. So I won't say too much, but I want you to see it with your own <laughs> eyes. Fair enough, fair enough. Okay, let's talk about the shows you're going to have in the Bay Area because it's not just one show, but you're going to be at three different locations over the course of the holiday time. So fill everyone in on, on what that Yeah, is. Shen Yu will be here in the Bay Area during the holiday seasons, always the holiday seasons. So in San Francisco, San Jose, in Berkeley from December 26th through mid-January. It is, again, using art form, you know, um, music and dance to really highlight the essence and also the best of humanity, courage, compassion, hope, integrity. It is a performance that you've been waiting for for a long time, <laughs> and at least to see it once in a lifetime. Yeah, very good. Well, I think it's great that there are going to be three opportunities. So again, just to tell everybody, it's San Jose, San Francisco, and Berkeley Indeed. are going to be hosting Shen Yun as we get into, uh, and it's family friendly, right? Oh, absolutely. It's uh, it's good for age from four to to 100. To 100, uh, okay. Yeah, and everybody will be captivated. It's a mesmerizing experience. My child, my personal child, she's been watching the show since four. Now she's oh, 11. Wow. Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, I think it'll be really fun for people to check out. So thank you so much for coming in and letting us know about it. We appreciate thank it. Thank you so much. So to